if you do not have the Gear 360 Action Director app, please visit Samsung.com. It is located in the Gear 360 2017 page. Welcome to Gear 360 Action Director. You have three types of video files to make projects. 360, HD video, and live broadcasting. Let's go to the live broadcasting by single clicking on it and allowing it to open. Since I am using a screen recorder, you do have to forgive me for not going any further than this page. Click on live, it's going to open up a window. It's going to ask you for your YouTube account, the email address. Fill it in, click next going to ask you for your password. Fill it in and enter. The next screen is going to either ask you for which YouTube channel you want. Click it and then it's going to manage it three different ways all checked. You click OK and it brings you back to this screen. You cannot just click live. You need to fill out the event, put anything in there, and you cannot simply click live again because it's going to ask you to fill out the description. It does not have any tags to fill out at this given time, but you can go public and your profile is your video resolution. 720p, HD 1080p, and possibly 2K7 from 15 frames to 30 frames per second. Then you're able to click the live button and you can broadcast live. It takes under one minute to set up. Once again, I cannot do live because I'm screen recording. You have the zoom that you can zoom in and out. You're broadcasting to YouTube. You have a sound bar and the icons of your camera, your battery, USB type C cable. You have a gear button that gives you the general information, social media, you're on YouTube, Facebook, and Samsung. You can connect over there by going over to the broadcast to YouTube, Facebook, Samsung, and custom. So once you start the broadcast, this will change to stop. The camera won't overheat because it's not using an SD card. When you are finished broadcasting, hit the stop button. Shut down the program by clicking on the X. Come over to the camera and click on the on and off button. The camera will shut off. Simply turn off your camera unplug it and you're finished. The one of the things I don't like about broadcasting via your home router wireless system is that you have the ability to go out there with your smartphone and broadcast. And I can't do that because I don't have a hotspot. And there is nowhere in this app that you can broadcast via the hotspot or live stream. Maybe in the future when they add this feature like Periscope and other companies will be able to broadcast. I have unlimited data and that's what I want to use to broadcast than to be stuck with a computer or being at home or on somebody's 
wireless system. If you're at the hotel, you may not be able to broadcast via their wireless router system. So this is how you broadcast via your own desktop through Wi-Fi. I hope this video has helped you out to broadcast with your Samsung. Any questions or comments, please post them below. Thank you and have a great day.